ya. Hello guys, we're here at Monster Village. This is a new rainbow colored suspension bridge for tourists that will be opening in central Taiwan. The 342 meter suspension bridge, which leads to the Double Dragon Waterfalls in Nantou County's Xinyi Township, is set to open to tourists on April 1st. The bridge hangs 110 meters above the ground, the equivalent to 30 stories, and is the highest and tallest suspension bridge open to tourists in Taiwan, according to the county. The Nantou Country Tourism Office said the most popular spots in the scenic area are the Double Dragon Trail, Suspension Bridge, and Double Dragon Waterfalls. The design of the bridge, which was built at a cost of 55 million new Taiwan dollars, is intended to give travelers the feeling of walking on a rainbow, with the colors changing every 50 meters. As they take in the coiling double dragon waterfalls and the vast valley below, the Nantou County government has recommended that the public take Grand Transit, Fung Rong K Yun, bus number 6288 from across the Shuili train station, Shui Li Huo Che, to visit the bridge and waterfalls. Saying that the road leading to the village near the bridge is narrow and that parking is limited. Shuanglong waterfall used to be a tall, single layer waterfall, but it split into two layers in 1999 due to the, the 921 earthquake, making it a tourist hot spot. The road linking the waterfalls with the outside world was destroyed by Typhoon Morakot in 2009, causing the popularity of the attraction to decline, however. The new bridge is intended to rekindle the public's interest. Coming to it every time, fear and then say, Please get down my side. I'm not your factor. Yeah. Can't find a scum boy yeah. and keep them in your hands and delete the 
chatting records. PYQ for three days on. Na 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 na. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. da.
The village is actually constituted by many stores selling local delights including monster bread, snacks and souvenirs. Next time when you visit Nantu, do not forget to stop by this charming, whimsical, and fun village themed around morbid looking yet lovely monsters that you cannot stop taking picture of them.